This is no mere ranger. He is Aragorn, son of Arathorn. You owe him your allegiance. And heir to the throne of Gondor. Have you heard nothing Lord Elrond has said? The ring must be destroyed. You have my sword. And you have my bow. And my axe. Krebine from Dunland! There is a fell voice on the air. Why doesn't that surprise me? Goblins. We must move on. We cannot linger. Bye, Govanen. Legolas Thranduilion. Govannas Vinguenene, Haldir Olorien. He was taken by both shadow and flame. A Balrog of Morgoth. For we went needlessly into the net of Moria. A lament for Gandalf. I have not the heart to tell you. For me, the grief is still too near. Lembas. Elvish waybread. One small bite is enough to fill the stomach of a grown man. We should leave now. No. Orcs patrol the eastern shore. We must wait for cover of darkness. It is not the eastern shore that worries me. A shadow under threat has been growing in my mind. Something draws near. I can feel it. The Horn of Gondor! Frodo and Sam have reached the eastern shore! You mean not to follow them? Not idly do the leaves of Lorien fall. They may yet be alive. Less than a day ahead of us. Come. Come, Gimli! We are gaining on them! I'm wasted on cross-country! We dwarves are natural sprinters! Very dangerous over short distances! Legolas, what do your elf eyes see? The Uruks turn northeast! They're taking the hobbits to Isengard! Saruman. The red sun rises. Blood has been spilled this night. I would cut off your head, dwarf, if it stood but a little higher from the ground. You would die before your stroke fell! This forest is old. Very old. Full of memory. And anger. <laughs> the trees are speaking to each other. Gimli! Feelings, my friend. The elves began it. Waking up the trees. Teaching them to speak. Talking trees. What do trees have to talk about? Hmm? Except the consistency of squirrel droppings. Aragorn nad no ennas. Approaches. Forgive me. I mistook you for Saruman. That is one of the Meras, unless my eyes are cheated by some spell. A scout! Aragorn! You lie. They have dollars. You look terrible. Farmers, barriers, stable boys. These are no soldiers. Most have seen too many winters. Or too few. Look at them. They're frightened. I can see it in their eyes. Boyahun. Nelet Herain. Dan Karmenik. Beriafarhun, Amar Nanedoras. Aragorn, Nedin Dagor, Hen Urir Othari. Nathadagathire. Then I shall die as one of them. 
We have trusted you this far. You have not led us astray. Forgive me. I was wrong to despair. That is no Orkhorn. Your friends are with you, Aragorn. Let's hope they last the night. What's happening out there? Shall I describe it to you? Or would you like me to find you a box? <laughs> Feige Vard. Dinalank. Anurak. Lengo Infinite! Regulus! Two already! I'm on 17! Ah! I'm a goat pointy out outscoring me! 19! Final count. 42. 42? Oh. That's not bad for a pointy-eared elvish princeling. <laughs> I myself am sitting pretty on 43. <laughs> 43. He was already dead. He was twitching. He was twitching? Cause he's got my axe embedded in his nervous system! No pauses. No spirits. And no regurgitation. So, it's a drinking. Last one standing wins. <laughs> oh, yes, the dwarves that go swimming with little hairy women. <laughs> I feel something. A slight tingle in my fingers. I think it's affecting me. Yeah. What did I say? He can't hold his liquor. Game over. The stars are veiled. Something stirs in the east. A sleepless malice. The eye of the enemy is moving. He is here. Horsemen! I wish I could muster a legion of dwarves, fully armed and filthy. Your kinsmen may have no need to ride a war. I fear war already marches on their own lands. The horses are restless. And the men are quiet. They grow nervous in the shadow of the mountain. That road there. Where does that lead? It is the road to the Dimwald, the door under the mountain. None who venture there ever return. That mountain is evil. Just where do you think you're off to? Not this time. This time you must stay, Gimli. Hmm. Have you learned nothing of the stubbornness of dwarves? You might as well accept it. We're going with you, laddie. What kind of army would linger in such a place? One that is cursed. Long ago, the men of the mountain swore an oath to the last king of Gondor. To come to his aid, to fight. But when the time came, when Gondor's need was dire, they fled, vanishing into the darkness of the mountain. And so Isildur cursed them, never to rest until they had fulfilled their pledge. Who shall call them from the grey twilight? The forgotten people. The heir of him to whom the oath they swore. From the north shall he come. Need shall drive him. He shall pass the door to the paths of the dead. The way is shut. It was made by those who are dead. And the dead keep it. The way is shut. What is it? What do you see? I see shapes of men. And of horses. Where? Pale banners like shreds of cloud. Spears writhe like winter thickets through a shroud of mist. The 
dead are following. They have been summoned. The dead? Summoned? I knew that. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Look at this! Not for ourselves. But we can give Frodo his chance if we keep Sauron's eye fixed upon us. Keep him blind to all else that moves. A diversion. Certainty of death? Small chance of success? What are we waiting for? I thought I'd die fighting side by side with an elf. What about side by side with a friend? <laughs>